Well, now to that trouble on the road this morning. Drivers in New Jersey stuck for upwards of six hours behind the scene of a fatal crash, and that led to even more accidents on the westbound bridge over the Hackensack River this morning. And there were at least 300 crashes on roadways in Westchester County. This video of a 17 car pileup oh. that killed one driver. Eyewitness News reporter NJ Burkett is live in New Rochelle. NJ? That's right, Sade. Safeway towing New Rochelle, New York. You see just some of the hundreds of cars that were damaged or destroyed this morning. Most of these cars, Sade, came from a single pileup, a chain reaction crash that happened out on the hutch. Some of the worst wreckage we've seen all day. Exit 7 off the Hutchison River Parkway in East Chester, where salvage teams cleared out what was left of a 30 car pileup. Literally dozens of cars in chain reaction crashes, most of them destroyed. Their steering wheels draped with deflated airbags, many with front and rear damage. Drivers said it was frightening. In my 20 years of driving is the first time I ever feel helpless there where there's nothing I could do. Car service driver Carlton Ellis told us he lost control on a ramp to the Cross County Parkway and totaled his minivan. It was a sheet of black ice and that's it. You couldn't stop? No, couldn't do anything, that's it. Ellis was lucky and he knows it. Another driver was killed in this pileup in the opposite lane. Westchester County Executive George Latimer. They spun out, lost control of the car and the driver got out of their car and then was hit by one of the cars behind them who also lost control. Latimer told us the shifting weather conditions last night made it impossible to treat the roads before the temperatures plunged. When we talked to our DPW folks, they indicated that the way this uh, weather conditions went, that had we brined the road yesterday, late yesterday, or even early yesterday evening, it would have washed away in the rain. Yet despite the forecast for icy roads, many drivers admitted they underestimated the conditions this morning, leading to hundreds of accidents in the span of just two hours. Awful, absolutely awful. I'm 28 years old. I've seen some car accidents, but this was just terrible. That black ice is no joke. No joke at all. You see the hazard lights on this car still flashing hours after the crash. Of course, those hazard lights wouldn't be doing any good on those icy roads because cars just plowed into one another chain reaction crashes. Uh, through it all, more than 300 accidents, untold numbers of injuries. Medics were busy all morning. And yes, one fatality. All of this taking place over the course of just two hours this morning.